The former president of Ghana, John Mahama, has raised alarm over the practice of capital flight from corruption amongst the developing countries. He said the development will worsen their growth if the international community does not enforce the conventions and declarations against corruption. Mahama gave the warning while delivering a keynote presentation at the 53rd Annual Conference of the Nigerian Institution of Estate Surveyors and Valuers in Ilori, the Kwara State Capital, with the theme, Asset Valuation as a Global Anti-Corruption Tool, the Nigeria Experience. The World Economic Forum estimates that the global cost of corruption is at least $2.6 trillion annually. The price of capital flight from corruption will worsen the growth of developing countries if the international community does not enforce the conventions and declarations against corruption. Mr. Chairman, the international community has embarked on a global anti-corruption fight across several sectors, including the real estate sector. While these initiatives have had a variable impact at staunching the flow of illicit financial revenues, definitely more needs to be done using all instruments available to the international community and individual nations in the fight against the canker of corruption. Mahama, however, challenged Nigeria to constantly strive to improve and enforce existing global anti-corruption convention designed to curtail the negative impacts of corruption. Transparency, Nigeria can better tackle corruption in the real estate sector and asset sector. Nigeria, like my country Ghana, however, is yet to maximize the potential of asset valuation as a tool for nation building and the fight against corruption. Our countries must constantly strive to improve and enforce existing global anti-corruption conventions designed to curtail the negative impacts of corruption on our national economies. If we are sincerely and genuinely desirous of meaningful development, we must do something about corruption. Meanwhile, governments alone cannot succeed in preventing and fighting corruption and corrupt practices without the cooperation and collaborative efforts of the private sector, state agencies, and critical stakeholders, including the professional organizations, particularly the estate surveying and valuation profession, whose roles and services are germane and key to the economic development. Hello, hope you enjoyed the news. Please do subscribe to our YouTube channel and don't forget to hit the notification button so you get notified about fresh news updates.